things a local glass shop can do for you. Let's say you have a coffee table or even a regular table and you need to decide what glass you need for it because there are two types of glass you really want to use for a tabletop. One is either annealed or tempered. If you have a tabletop where the glass is the tabletop and it is freestanding, you want to use a tempered glass and I'll show you the reason for that in just a minute because of the way it breaks, you want tempered glass. If you are using, have a tabletop where you're just protecting the tabletop, you wanna use annealed and I'll show you the reason for that here in a second. So we're gonna start out with the annealed. So let's say you've got this piece of glass on your flat tabletop and it's protecting that tabletop and you have rambunctious kids that love to play ball in the house. So they're in the house and they got the ball and they're throwing it around and oh, it breaks. So normally it wouldn't be that dramatic because I'm not every little kid plays with the bowling ball in the house, but you want it to break into bigger pieces like this on that flat surface because you will notice it didn't go anywhere. Um, so it doesn't blow up like tempered glass is going to and go everywhere and your flat sur surface literally turns into a launch pad for glass to fly away. And normally if you set a cup down hard or anything like that, it's just gonna break into one or two pieces. And that is a lot safer than what happens with, sorry, making noise here. But when you have a piece of tempered glass, which is what you want, if it is a freestanding tabletop and those rambunctious kids come back and they get the bowling ball out and it blows up. You see how it shot out like that. The reason you want tempered glass to break like that and when it's a freestanding table is because if you do fall through it, you've got these tiny little chunks. You may still get cut, but you're gonna get smaller cuts where if it had been annealed like this and it broken into bigger chunks, you have bigger chunks of glass cutting your arms. So that is the reason why if it's a freestanding tabletop, you want the glass to be tempered, but if it's on there just protecting it, usually the better choice is to go with a kneel glass so it just does break into those two pieces and doesn't go anywhere. And on a flat surface, if there hadn't been the cardboard here, I'm just too lazy to clean it up, so I wanted to do that. If this card hadn't board hadn't been here, glass would travel as far as 10 feet from that flat surface. So if you got a, knit, a table or need a tabletop made of glass, call your local glass shop. See what they can do for you. Support small business.